Oh, it's you. Well, don't get too excited. That bear and I just had some unfinished business. Why are you looking at me like that? With that weird gleam in your eye? Don't tell me you're going to keep bothering me. FML. So, I'm a wolf. All my boyhood dreams have come true. Too bad I was such a dumbass little kid. I hate everything about this. Yeah, I keep looking over at the elderly yoga classes in the park. We really gotta fix this before I go all animal planet on those guys. Name's Volks. And just in case you feel like getting cute and adding wagon to that at some point, I would like to remind you my jaws can crush a moose's femur in six or seven bites. This quest to change me back better not involve the power of friendship or the power being in me all along, or any of that crap. I wouldn't get any closer if I were you. I'm not saying I'll bite you, but I'm not not saying it either. Great. Now I get to wear a fur coat everywhere I go. In the summer. Lucky me. That... I didn't ask for your help. But if you want to waste your time bothering me, I guess I can't stop you. Does this mean I'm stuck with you for now? Well, at least being turned into a wolf isn't the worst part of all this anymore. If you see that bear again, just ask her what she did with all the puppies her last lover bought her. The awkwardness will drive her off. My sense of smell is a billion times stronger. In a world where showering is optional. We. All oh, the better to eat you with! Oh, whoops. Sorry. I was just practicing. Never know when opportunity's gonna knock. There's a lot more screaming and people running away in my day-to-day -day life now. It's already old. Way less fun than I imagined. I've been petting my fur backwards, on purpose. It reminds me there are no good boys in this world. There are only dogs leading the blind. Bad folks. No treat for you. I hate everything about this. Last night, I crept to your window and contemplated mauling you. But knowing my luck, you're probably loaded with gluten or something. So I spared you. I recommend you figure out how to break that curse sooner, rather than later. Alright, alright. Don't get all touchy-feely on me. You're good people. Now get out of my bubble. A dog catcher has been poking around, asking questions. I may have acquired a mortal enemy. Here's a tip. Swan boats? aren't made for wolves. Real shocker, I know. Also, wet wolves smell a lot like wet dogs. So now we've got that to enjoy. I think you'll save time if you just ask who's not afraid of the big bad wolf. Because so far, the alternative is a bloody long list. That roller coaster almost killed me. Let's do it again. I hate everything about this. Don't get used to having me around. If you can't break this curse, I'm probably going to run away to the wilderness. Or Wall Street. A wolf's gotta do what a wolf's gotta do. The moon is super interesting now. It's so shiny. I want to bite it. I have murdered like nine tennis balls today. Don't give me that look. I can quit whenever I want. Listen, I've got an itch on my ear. Shut up. Just help. Don't make a big deal out of it. I buried a bone. Just to see how it felt. I guess I'm domestication curious. No, I won't give the bone back. That skeleton had it coming. And I've already buried it. It just isn't happening.
So, you're saying we should try kissing? Fine. But this better not have been some ruse or weird fetish. I'm not above biting faces. Well, here goes nothing. So, we've got a kiss for this to work? Lame. Alright, here goes nothing. Well, look at that. I'm back to normal. Ish. At least my junk isn't fuzzy anymore. Yes, I can tell that right away. This is honestly a lot further than I expected you to get. No offense. I don't do dinner conversations. And you can't make me. I thought for a moment you were wearing a hot new body spray. Then I realized that that's just what you smell like. And it's delicious. We, we should keep working on this curse. Sunsets are the worst. Lazy old sun. Moonlight or bust for me. Hold still for a sec. I'm trying to think of something mean to say about you. It's becoming noticeably harder. And I'm starting to get worried. So, I admit, you're not as unpleasant to hang around as I suspected. So, if you're aiming at being at least tolerable, nice job. On the other hand, if you were aiming higher than that, well, never mind. Having hands again is pretty sweet, I guess. Don't take your thumbs for granted. Um, this is pretty nice. Why are you giving this to me? What are you up to? I can hear your heart beating from over here with these ears. Also, what you had for lunch. The world is constantly gross and sentimental as hell. Great, I'm partially transformed back. Now everyone can be completely sure that I'm some kind of freak. Whatever. I think I liked the ride better when I kept almost drowning. You ever wake up with a hair in your mouth? Try waking up with a tail in your mouth. I'm getting called a furry a lot. I'm also still biting a lot of people. These things are connected. I don't have many people. I wouldn't mind if you wanted to be one. I mean, if you don't make a big deal out of it. Okay. Just don't go running off to update your Facebooks or whatever. It's annoying. Next time, let's tie up the ride operator and turn the speed up. What you doing today? I mean, I'm probably doing stuff. May as well do it together. Do you? I don't know. Do you want to be a thing with me, I guess? Okay, fine. Whatever. It's not like I'm going to say no at this point. I slashed the dog catcher's tires today. I'm not going to lie. It felt pretty damn great. I left a steak for you in your mailbox. I apologize, because I know how weird that is. Don't make it worse than it already is. You're nice to look at. Good job on your... Face. You're not as annoying as before. Still kinda annoying, but manageable. I was thinking about sitting across from you in a cafe and staring at you for an hour. You busy? Do you want to do, I don't know, normal stuff? Hang out? Light things? Work with me here. Or the next time you touch me, I'm going to touch you back. I can't eat. I can't sleep. You're ruining me. Just say you'll be here tomorrow. We'll call it even. I'm gonna kiss you now. Hey, I took this picture for you. I lost my shirt and didn't feel like finding another, I guess. You're welcome. Hit me up for more dates. Or not. Whatever. Hey, things are less awful when you're around. So stop leaving. I'm warning you. 
Paw prints on my junk, huh? Subtlety isn't your strong point. The next time you touch me, I'm going to touch you back. Stop looking at me like that. I do not still have a wolf-like obsession with bones. I just think I look tasty in this costume. I mean tasteful. I said tasteful. The next time you touch me, I'm going to touch you back. Yeah, okay. I could curl up and take a nap in this. Though if you were to get up for a glass of water or something, I'd probably wake up and follow you. Stop calling me a good boy. I know what you're doing. I don't care if I like it anyway. I want to stare into your eyes until it's super awkward. I don't know why. It just makes me happy. I'm not saying I need a hug, but if you were to trip and fall on me, I wouldn't complain about it today. Hey, wanna go be aloof somewhere? I want you. I want you to want me. The strength of the pack is the wolf, and the strength of the wolf is the pack. I want to stare into your eyes until it's super awkward. I don't know why, it just makes me happy. I still try to scratch my ch- You're in trouble, because I have your scent, and the big bad wolf is coming to get you. I might giggle once for you. On your birthday, no sooner. Seriously, I don't giggle. See, I might get. I legit want to go look at stars with you. I thought that was just a stupid thing they put into movies for sappy saps. Oh, hey. I was just thinking about you. Which is probably lame to say, since I don't really stop. Sometimes, I miss being a wolf. I'm not as good at digging now, or carrying things in my mouth. What? It was useful! Oh, good, it's you. The list of people I would rather have popping in is very short. Like, zero short, I guess.